What's up guys, my name is Carlos Berto. Thank you so much for stopping by my YouTube channel this week. So today what I want to do is do a hairstyle tutorial video with you guys. And essentially what I want to do is just teach you guys how to manage wavy curly hair. When your hair is short to medium length, it starts to get a little bit more difficult to manage your hair because your waves start to grow in. Uh, you could definitely get to see the depth of your curls. And also just your manageability kind of goes away when you have anywhere from four inches to above your hair starts to develop its own character and it feels like it's totally against you. So today what I want to do is just do a quick hairstyle tutorial video that you guys could do if you have hair like this and give you guys some ideas and pointers on how I style my hair. So so let's go ahead and begin this video right now. So as you can see my hair right now is about four inches on top. I have a nice cowlick right here. It gives me a lot of volume. It really helps me out. It could definitely be annoying sometimes but there's always a good trick to manage your cowlick a little bit better. So as far as the measurements right now my hair is about four inches, four and a half inches on top and the sides are just tapered down. Uh, they were tapered down a few weeks ago to like maybe like a one guard, not, nothing too crazy. And now it's kind of back to like getting a little bit crazy. And my hair was a lot shorter as you guys saw in my previous videos. And now I'm just letting it grow longer and just allowing myself to have more fun with a longer hairstyle. So let's go ahead and begin this video and begin this process right now. So I know when you have wavy curly hair, a lot of us tend to want more of that fine straighter hairstyle hair look. And a lot of times it's almost impossible to get unless you use a flat iron. But there is a nice way you can actually enhance your curls to make them straighter and also keep that voluminous texture that wavy hair types gives to you naturally. So right now my hair is completely dry and I have not put any product. I did put some heat protectant in it and I did blow dry it. Now what I'm just going to do is go ahead and begin using this round brush comb in a little bit of heat, medium setting, so I could start giving my hair some direction and also just taking a little bit weight off of this curl and making it just a little bit more straight. So let's do this right now. As you can see right now, my hair is nice and still wavy. It still has some natural texture to it. It still has volume. I did not lose any volume. All I did was really enhance this front fringe right here just so it won't be too kinky and too curly. And I have like a nice wave going this direction. It's not just a bunch of curly hair like it was before. And now what I'm gonna do is apply some product so I could uh, style it and make this hairstyle voluminous. So let's go ahead and do this right now. Now I'm gonna go ahead and use some chapter styling cream right here and this is going to be a good cream to use because it does have a natural hold it has a nice pliability to it if your hair is thick and curly then you don't really want your hair to be tugged even if your hair is a little bit thin this is a great product because it won't pull or tug your hair out and it does emulsify very easily and it has all these great ingredients that that just help induce healthy and great hair so let's go ahead and apply some of this right now <music>
So what I did is brush coming to the right and now I just tossed it over to the left because that way I'm going to get the most volume, maximize my volume because it's going against the grain that my hair grows and falls. So it was just going to stand a little bit taller when it's pushed the opposite way. And that's definitely a good tip that you guys should definitely try out on your own hair. You will see a big difference in volume. So this is what I'm going to be rocking today. As you can see, it has nice messy volume. I highly recommend you guys do this hair hack uh, when you're doing your hair. So this is what I'm gonna be rocking today. As you can see, I have nice volume. Let's see the back. When it comes to styling and better managing wavy curly hair it's always great just to be a little bit more patient and not necessarily go ahead and cut it all off because i know that for me at least when i have longer hair like i do now even a little bit longer i tend to want it short and when it's super short i just want my hair back so i'm just having fun in the process and trying out different hairstyles as well which i will be doing in the next video so make sure that if you guys have any recommendations or want me to try out a specific hairstyle then let me know down below in the comment section i'll make sure i do that so just a good hair hack a good hair tip that you guys could take away from this video is by yourself a really good brush comb that's not too big and also get yourself a nice hair dryer and use the medium setting not all the way hot and also if you guys are into getting a good hairstyle chapter hairstyling cream really did apply very easily and emulsified very well in my hands and it did not pull or tug i have no hair on my hands usually a lot of products do that that's just not what we formulated for you guys so if you guys are interested in checking that out please make sure you do at chapterhair.com and also we are uploading a lot of different blog content for all you guys to enjoy and it's all hair related everything so if you're here because of hair make sure you stop by that blog because there's a lot a lot of hair content so that's what i have for you guys today thank you so much for stopping by my youtube channel i hope you guys enjoy this video let me know if you, what you guys think about this hairstyle or what i should do next i'm at by carlos roberto on instagram if you guys are interested don't forget to post on everything peace